Hello everyone, I am Harsh and today we are going to learn a Prism region component like how to use the region in WPF publication. Before I start the video, I would say let's subscribe this channel to get more update on the Prism. Without wasting the time, let's get started. First, we will see what is region. A region is a container for views within a WPF application. It's used to specify where a view should be displayed within the main window. Now we will see how to use the region in our WPF application. So I will add region in main view window. So go to main view.javan file and add the name space for the prism. Like use xmlns and then prism. And then I will say this one. I will select first one prism library component. Okay. Now I want to add three region. I will make it doc panel. I will remove this. For now, as a region is a container, it can contain the controls. So we have to use here content control. And then I will use Prism, region manager, and then region name. Here I will say toolbar region. In the same way, I will add three region here. One is sidebar, and another is main content or content region. And this will be on top. Doc panel dot doc should be top. In the same way, I will add to right this sidebar. I will say right, and it will be whatever space is left where we will have all the content. Now we have added the region to our UI. Now it's time to show or display the UI to this region. Now it's time to create the view which we are going to display on the window now let's create three new views so inside the views folder i will add three views click on add click on new item or you can select user control from here i will say toolbar view okay and click on add and again i will add one more user control not page user control and here i will say side bar view and then content view okay now our view is ready in the view i will add one text block and i will just say text equal to this is content view this is content view in the same way i will add in other view also this is sidebar view and then this is toolbar view okay now our views are ready now it's a time to register the view with region how to register it we have different way to register but i want to register in the app.jml.cs file so here i will override one method called on initialize because on initialize we want this view to be displayed in main window right so i will say override and then on initialized how to register the view with view region for that we need region manager so i will resolve the region manager using container in the same way like this and here i will say i region manager okay and then add the namespace for this using prism dot regions now it's added using this now we can register our view with region region dot i would say here region manager dot register view with region okay now we have to give here region name and then the view name or we can give like this first i will register this toolbar view so select the i will copy this name and add it here and then we have to give the region name which is this one in the same way we can register for all sidebar and the sidebar region and then content view content 
region. Okay, now let's run and see. We can see here this is toolbar view, this is sidebar view, this is content view, right? So this is how we can show the view with region in WPF application using Prism. Here I want to change this to left. So I can say left also. Let's run. You can see here, right? All the view are displayed in main view. I hope you learn how to use the region component of Prism in WPF application. That's all for this video. If you found this video helpful, let's share with your friends.